It's Sunday brunch. Time to go out for a bite and maybe kick back a little. This is really good. Do you know it would be even better? More drinks. More drinks. Except this brunch is going to be a bit boozy. Bartender, one more round. <laughs> These are awesome. In fact, this guy is having such a great time, he's forgotten that for him, this is no day off. Oh my god. I have to work today. You guys, I gotta go. I'm hasty. Sorry. I'll see you guys later. Not only is he late for work, he's clearly still intoxicated. And he gets there just as this woman pulls in looking for a valet. That's right, he is the valet attendant. And parking may be a lot bigger headache than his hangover. Of course, it's all a setup. From our fake valet stand to the rented car. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah. We even trained our actor to safely knock over a few props on the street with the help of this stunt driver. What I want you to do is drive into the trash can yeah. and slam on the brake quick. Cool. How will the people of Montclair, New Jersey react when they see a drunk valet attendant get behind the wheel? What would you do? I'm actually drunk. I was at brunch and I had like five mimosas. He tries to sober up, asking for a little help from a nearby water stand. I'm sorry to interrupt. Can I get a water? I'm actually a little queasy. I, I, I need to sober up. But there's no time to pull it together. He's got a new customer. Oh, shoot, I got to go. And now, will this family blow the horn on his drinking and driving? Hi, can I help you with anything? Would Good? you park my car, please? They notice, but they don't say a word as Mary walks right past them. Well, guess what's about to happen now? They're stunned. Oh, no, 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 no. Where did the lady go? AZ freaks out. It's OK. He doesn't want to get in okay. trouble or worse, fired. Can you just keep this quiet? I'll to oh, I'll totally fix it. We send Mary back out. I forgot my glasses in oh, the I'll car. Oh, I'll get her. Now will he keep our drunks secret? Hey, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. It turns out Nate Asamir just cannot tell a lie. Yes, Nate. Thank you. Messed up her car. You can't just. No, but. Do it okay. well, why do you get it? Oh my gosh. There's a scratch on your car? I don't no, I don't think, think so, there's a scratch. Are you sure he did it? I saw him. You we saw all him? saw it. No, really? you didn't. I'm no. going to call the police. I'm Things are getting serious now, and AZ pretends he's the one who's going to suffer. Why did you guys have to say something? You know what you did wrong, right? You're trying to cover it up. Why don't you just but say, you, why don't you tell her what happened? I could actually get fired. I don't know what to tell you, man. You should have thought about that first, but you hit her car. She needs to know. That's her for her to make the call. All right, break it, break it. All right, here we go. Hi there. How are you? Hi. I'm John Quinones with the you TV what? show. I thought, that's what, I, thought, I thought that's what it was. What were you thinking? He said that he had a rough night last night. I'm like, wow, maybe he shouldn't be working. And you were just like, don't say anything. No, not that don't say anything, but I said maybe we could have done it differently. <laughs> Quietly tell the lady, now everybody's involved, everybody's watching. You've got that right, and they won't be the only ones watching. Oh, oh God, oh, who, who put this? Hey, can you guys just like not say anything? Like, who? Like ah. between us, I had at brunch like a few. We don't need to know. Hairs. We don't need to know. Okay. Okay. I forgot my glasses in the car. When Mary returns, no hesitation here. Right, yeah. we hit the I got garbage can. No, I didn't. Here you Thank you. Excuse <laughs> me? Listen you. Hey, buddy. Oh, don't dear. Be this is a little old lady. Don't be a I'm not. Own up to, your, own up to what? John, I call the police. John, no, you know what, John? No. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Care. Loud, condemning right. reaction. Sorry. Um, Pretty I impressive. Didn't I didn't. Next, along come these women who are a pair of jokers. I just came from brunch. I had a little bit too much to drink and I need to sober up. Yeah. yeah. You park in my car. Can I park your car? Are you guys going? No, Hold on, no, buddy. No, no, no. I need <laughs> the water. I just got my mini. You want your mini forever. <laughs> and when Mary pulls up, they turn into a pair of psychics. Oh, Hearing into the future. Wait, 
like when Phoebe hits the garbage. Yeah, I was just like, you know. Or the bike. Now, will they defend our drunk valet? Did you? Did anybody hear anything? It was an empty trash can. Do you think? I don't. Do you think he did any damage? No. Now, say to the ladies, I think he's been drinking. Have Mary say to the ladies. He smells a little like alcohol. He was never. He was never that close to us. We don't. We don't know. But you heard a crash. No, we didn't. We didn't really see anything. Didn't see anything. Time to get to the bottom of this. I'm Joanne Quinones with the TV show What Would You Do? Oh no. <laughs> you kind of protected the valet guy. We feel bad for I'm good for the underdog. Even if he was drunk. Uh, we don't know. Well, we don't know drunk, that he was drunk because he him. never, like, he never got into our face close enough uh, to say, yeah, he was definitely drinking. I mean, we protected both people. Throughout the day, others find it difficult to turn him in. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. What was that noise? Did you hear something? Uh, I went in there and I heard this kind of, oof, I don't know. Between us? Uh, okay. You have to do something about yourself. Yeah, it's I not will. Right. This next woman couldn't agree more. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, this guy is loaded. So much you really call a cop Now Mary's back again, searching for those glasses. Car, Your glasses you in the car. Them? Yeah, absolutely. I, I think I'll go get them. Yeah. On the passenger seat? Absolutely. Um, excuse me, ma'am. He just hit your yeah, car into that. He hit my car? What happened? What do you mean? No. I'll call the police if you want. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Uh, Everyone just saw oh. you. And that's it. Leah Rothfritz loses her patience and calls the cops. 911, where's your emergency? Yeah, the valley parking guy just, I think he's drunk, and he yeah. just drove yeah. into a garbage can. He just drove into a garbage can? You get fired, man. But you're saying I'm a liar and I'm not. No, I'm not saying, it's just that you didn't you, see. I'm sorry, the guys you like arguing with you didn't, right now. You didn't actually see yes, what I happened. No. Well, Crazy argue no more. Okay. The police, of course, already know we're here. And the only lights she'll see are the lights of our cameras. I'm John Quinones with the TV show, What Would You Do? Oh my God. <laughs> I'm having like anxiety right now. Okay, oh my God. Okay. <laughs> you felt you had to say something? Yes, for sure. I didn't want him to drive away and hurt someone else. The moral of the story is speak up, huh? Because right. he could kill somebody. Hi guys, John Quinones here. Thanks so much for checking out our YouTube channel. There's so much more to see. So click on this red button down here, the one that says subscribe, and you won't miss another What Would You Do moment. Enjoy.